all right guys what is up it's your boy will back with another video today hope you guys are doing good in this video I'll be talking about camber energy ticker symbol cei don't worry i will write it out to make the ticker symbol a little bigger and the second one mullen automotive ticker symbol m u l n i know you guys want updates on these so i will be updating you guys on some new levels we'll also go what happened with the old levels and how these old levels will actually help us create new buying levels to buy at i have not bought either of them but i was very close to buying mullen automotive today i'll tell you why and then i'll tell you why i did not so let's go ahead and go into it for some new buying levels make sure you guys smash the like button subscribe if you are new make sure you turn your post notifications so you don't miss the updates and share the video out to your friends and family so we can spread that knowledge so let's go ahead let me drop down oh let me write out the ticker symbol also so this is camber energy ticker symbol cei i also think a lot of money poured in here because of the uh the russia stuff so a lot of money went into the energy type of sector if you look at all the energy stocks they kind of been moving cei right there take that off O levels buying level exit level buying level x level i had them color coordinated so you guys know which levels went to what what happened today the buying level right around a dollar 14 did not confirm today came down a little bit tried to go up broke it tried to show a little pressure again broke it again and then what you see right here specifically when it broke and came back up look how it tested as a resistance okay that was a sign to not buy so i won't be buying here or exiting there what i'll be doing is we're actually going to clear these levels also so the new buying level that i'll be looking at let me go back to the 90 day 30 minute chart make sure you guys smash that like button subscribe if you are new the new level is actually lower so i actually want to see a little bit more drop it's about 85 cents 85 cents is a buying level that i'll be looking currently because since that buying pressure didn't occur up here it makes me feel like it wants to drop more because if you look at this first run it had a over about a 40 four percent drop before it uh did that second run now this one i'm pretty sure it should be down more than 44 percent so about 45 percent so kind of almost the same drop as that did but this one will be a little bigger because this run was bigger than the first run that we had in cei if we look at the first run the run was about 109 percent and then if we look at this run the run was 245 percent so now you see why i'm expecting a, li a little more pullback because this run was this run was almost three times this run so i'm not expecting a three times type of drop but i am expecting a bigger drop than 40 percent so the buying level around 85 cents will actually take us to about a 57 percent drop so it only needs about 10 more cent drop to kind of get in those areas but that's why i feel better buying now because i was looking at this previous run looking at the drawdown and this right here makes sense i think it might need to draw down some more like i said volume is dying down on this one you can tell by here a lot of volume came in volume volume you see how volume is slowly dying down which is kind of bringing that price down but i feel once it gets towards this buying level around 85 cents the only buying level i'm looking at now also is uh hopefully that volume picks up hopefully we get some momentum in it hopefully people start buying it up and then it can start pushing it to higher prices my first exit will be around that one dollar mark so 85 cents to a dollar mark will be about a 18 percent gain now once we get up here i will sell half because i think we will see some type of resistance um, on camber energy at this level that then i'll try to hold the other half to kind of run that's why i say just make sure to buy and sell signals group first link in the description but these are the main two levels all new levels i'm looking for right now camber energy and if we get brown pressure here i will go a little heavier so this run this run for 18% can be a nice little chunk of change, okay? Just imagine you put 100 grand here and you get 18%. That's 18, that's 18 grand and just a 15 cent type of move, okay? So kind of give you a kind of example of how I'm trying to play it. So main two levels for CEI. All right, guys, video is sponsored by me. Big, big, big announcement with Momo. You can get your Momo account, second link in the description. You can deposit any amount to get up to three free stocks. I, again, you can deposit any amount to get up to three free stocks. Once you open your account, you automatically get one free stock worth of $3 to $3,500. And then you can deposit any amount to get one free stock worth $9 to $3,500. And then you also get a free share of NEO. Okay, so if you ever want to own NEO, this is your time to own it for free. 
This is only good until March 31st. So this is your time to start getting a free share of NEO. You also get, you could deposit a dollar and you almost make over a thousand percent return on your dollar because you'll get a, a one stock worth of three dollars thirty five hundred nine dollars thirty five hundred and also a free share of neo so make sure you get your momo account second link in the description do not miss it also make sure you get your buy and sell signals and so know when i'm buying and selling for options and shares we do have the original signals right here you get my buys and sells we also have a chat room where we talk in the markets every day we also have a crypto room where we talk also so make sure you join make sure you get the vip vip is almost full once it is full it will be closed so make sure you get the VIP. You get four monthly live teaching Zooms. You actually get one every week. You get 24 seven access to the crash course. So the crash course does come in the VIP. You also get your own VIP structuralized plan to better help you trade in this market. Like I said, VIP is more of me teaching you how to trade. So make sure you join. All these prices are going up soon. So make sure you join now. And also if you trade Forex, make sure you come join the Forex Academy. We teach you guys how to trade over here in Forex. Very, very, very important if you guys are in the forex market you get 20 percent so your own crash course trade breakdowns live zooms all that and then stock market options crash course you can use will have fall to still get 50 percent off stock market options crash course and let's go back to the video second one mullen automotive ticker symbol m-u-l-n ticker symbol m-u-l-n and let me show you why i did not buy today we did have some old levels if i um buying level right around a dollar and 10 cents what happened today buying pressure even if we go on a five minute buying pressure came down try to get some buying pressure okay ticker symbol m-u-l-n let me go ahead and write it out for you guys before i forget make sure you guys smash the like button and subscribe if you have not already there you go ticker symbol u I mean, M-U-L-N. And make sure you guys let me know if you want to update on these. So just comment, update. And then if anything changes, I'll update you guys later today or tomorrow on them. So buying level we had right around a dollar and 10 cents. What happened at that level? Just tried to get a little buying pressure. Died down. Came back up. First resistance. Died down. Came back up again. What do we see? When a buying pressure acts as resistance, that's usually bearish. And we're starting to see that pullback. So what that happens is I was going to buy it down here. Okay, I was very close to buying it, like putting in a little shares, but I feel it might drop a little bit lower. So I do have a buying level now, a new one. Let's go ahead and clear the chart. And also if it does not drop down to this buying level, I actually might buy a little above it. It all depends on when it wants to start moving again. It had the run, had that big pullback, kind of had a smaller run here. Might do a little drop down again and then try to go um, to the moon. But the first level and only level I'm looking at right now is 97 cents. So in that 97 cents area is the buying pressure that I'm currently looking for now. First exit, probably be a dollar and 20 cents. So from nine, 97 cents to a dollar 20 cents, be about a 23 uh, type of gain. So a little bigger percentage on this second penny stock. Again, these are penny stocks, so make sure you watch your risk management, but a little more gains on this one. And then once we get up to that 120, depending on the selling pressure, I might hold it to like 140 to 150 to get about a 50% return. But like I said, all depends on what happens around this buying level around 97 cents. And then tomorrow, um, it, it can um, also occur tomorrow. I might buy a little higher than this price. It just all depends on if it hits this level, if it opens a little higher and so on and so forth. But like I said, if you want to update, just comment update and I'll try to update you guys on both of these. But these are new levels that I'm kind of looking out for. We'll be going a little heavier also on both of these to kind of get those bigger gains and these smaller type of moves. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Always remember, no recommendation to buy or sell anything, just for educational purposes only. So do not trade anything you see or hear in the video and I'll catch you guys in the next one.